Hey guys, I uh, got my enclosure together. Didn't have uh, too many problems after the getting the, the left side on. The rest of the panels go on pretty easy. I like. I didn't realize the top would have a window on it too, which is, is kind of nice. Let's light get in. Uh, the only issue, oh, I guess there is one issue I didn't mention. I uh, did the doors, but look, there's a, an overlap of about mm, eighth of an inch. So they don't actually close together. And there's no way to have them further apart. I've got, you know, this, all the way it can go in this uh, hinge, and the same as this. So I'm not sure what to make of that. Um... I can always use a router and take off like a quarter inch from the one door so it sit flush and butt up against this correctly. But other than that, I'm not quite sure what to do. I don't really feel like modifying any of the metal structure to recess those hinges. Maybe I could think of an easier way to do it. I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, I've had enough of playing with this. I'm going get to on, get on to the uh, rest of the electronics and computer setup. Uh, I think next I'm probably going to do the uh, control components for the flood coolant. And so I got to flip the mill around and get access to the electrical panel and add those components. Um, uh, I'll, yeah, I'll do some, I'll film some of that too. So uh, bear with me here. Thanks. All right, I got the machine turned around so I can see the back of it easier. Took off the back access panel and there's a lot of wires in there. <laughs> So I thought it would be kind of simple. It looks like there's a lot of steps to this. I've got to clip in these three components, so I think right here somewhere. And then there's like four or five pages on how to wire it in. So uh, all right, I guess I'll do it one step at a time here and hopefully it goes just fine. Um, okay, so I got two of them clipped in. So I got, I got a light shine on here to try to, uh, I don't know if that's helping or not. Maybe that's better. Um, it's kind of, I'm not familiar with this kind of wiring system, but it looks, I, I, it's actually pretty tidy. These, each of these components has a little clip thing and just clips on a rail. It's kind of pleasantly surprised at how simple that was to put on. So it's just a matter of hooking it on and clipping it. And now there's a bunch of wires to connect. <laughs> okay, hold on again. So the first step was just to pull out one of these connectors out and attach two wires. The instructions are actually pretty good. They show exactly where to put the wires and pull the plug out. And so the first one was just attach two wires. And then put plug back in. All right. Now there's still some more wires, so let me look at the next step. The next two are pretty straightforward. There was a uh, number 91 and number 100 from these two. I just had to root them through here, and they both fit in that block down there, and then just fixed in with screws. So what does it leave me with? I got one wire there. I thought there was more wires. Oh, the interface plug for the pump. That's got to go somewhere too. Okay, let's take another look at the instructions. All right, I fed the pl power plug in for the coolant pump. So it's got just three wires there to connect, and then there's just one other one here to connect up, and that should be it. So I will check the instructions again and see where those go. And got the last wires in. I'd missed one in the first step. There was uh, one that went from this guy over to fuse number one. Fuse number one. Missed that. And then I connected the three from the power supply. Green goes to ground over there. Uh, black connected... Where did that go? Oh, to this uh, relay block. And the white just connected up to this... Uh, here, which in turn I think goes into the what is that transformer? Yeah, 
Okay, so that should be all the electrical. I can button this back up, and of course everything goes right the first try, and I'll just assume it's fine. And then I can start actually hooking up the computer, and everything should magically work. Alright, thanks guys.